open an extend and go to file new go to machining and in relationship you can keep it as stand alone and select the folder where you want to save the part and give a proper name and when you click OK next thing the NX software asks is to select the machining environment you have to select two configuration in cam session configuration you need to select cam general and in cam setup you can use mill planer and click OK so this is case one where you need to uh, create a model for creating a toolpath. Let's say you have already got a CAD model. So th this is the CAD model. and you go into application and click on manufacturing and then again it will ask for machine environment templates that is cam session configuration and cam setup you can use the same cam general and mill planer and click ok or else you can open this part go to file new and here you can use reference existing part and go to select general setup and you can see that in part to reference already the part which we have opened has come in uh, here and NX10 will be selecting this uh, CAD model and using the templates of general setup to create a manufacturing environment. Or you can just click file new, go to reference existing part and you can select any of the part to reference. and you can define the units here you can switch between inches and millimeters now this is the graphic interference area and this is the toolbar these are the menu bars we have insert action operations display workpiece analysis geometry synchronous model and feature this is the operation navigate navigator and these are the resource bar and this part is not uh, having any operations so I'll uh, close this part So this is a 3D model of the machine, this is the tool magazine table and this is the head, tool head. So as I mentioned in the slide, in uh, there are different ways of viewing the operation. We will start with program order view. Here the programs are arranged in, I mean the operations are arranged under program name. So if you create different program names all those program names will be visible and if we have create operation for different programs all those 
programs and operations is visible in operation navigator and if you want to view this program in I mean operations in machine tool view that is based on the tools that we use for machining this part here we have used three tools and each tool is held in pocket one two three of tool magazine so if you select the tool we can see that which tool is going to fit in spindle and where it starts machining so this will be very helpful to identify how many operations uses this particular tool and if you go to geom uh, geometry view we can see that all these operations are coming under particular geometry and if you use machining method view we have different machining methods here that is mill rough mill semi finish and mill finish and drill method mainly for milling we use these three uh, methods and all the operations that we create uh, will go and sit in either rough or semi finish or finish based on the uh, the style or strategy of the operation